Okay, uh, Prime Minister Trudeau, welcome to Kingston. Uh, I also want to say that I am a proud Canadian and a veteran of 36 years, although my question has absolutely nothing to do with being a veteran. Uh, I'm also a transgender advocate, and I am extremely happy that C-16 looks like it's going to pass and through the Senate very shortly. Um, but what I want to talk about is one of the after effects of C-16, and that is with Corrections Canada. Corrections Canada has, in the past, been doing what I consider torture of transgender inmates by placing, like, especially trans women, in a prison for men. Now, you would not, of course, consider the fact that a woman of any other uh, type would be uh, put in a men's prison, but trans women have been. This is especially of a concern when you read that one article out of uh, Australia where a trans woman claims she had been raped over 2,000 times. Now, uh, I'm not saying that happens in Canada. Uh, I strongly suspect a lot of trans women are put into segregation, which is not much better than solitary confinement. So my question to you is, will you uh, do your best to ensure that trans women are put in prison uh, or prison more appropriate to their gender identity? Um, the answer is yes. Um, I will ensure that. I mean, this is a great example of of the uh, uh, the value of of having these community meetings like this and these town halls. Because I'll admit, uh, I consider myself to be a fairly strong advocate for uh, for LGBTQ2 issues and, and uh, fairly uh, aware of all the different pressures and this wasn't one that I had ever thought of. So thank you uh, for bringing it forward and I will make sure that we, uh, we look at it and we address it and uh, we do right in recognizing that uh, trans rights are human rights, that uh, we need to make sure that we are uh, defending everyone's dignity and uh, rights in every way we can uh, and this is something that uh, if we're not already addressing it, and I, and I hope we're starting to address it even without my uh, leaning in on it. Uh, now we will take a closer look at it. Thank you.